that's the Terence X Lite Pro and let's see how to update the firmware of the radio itself so it's OpenTX let's check the version first so I'll push that joystick to the left hold it by the way it's already updated the font is different we are on the first page out of 7 let's go to the left so it's OpenTX version 2.3.9 it was 2.3.0 before so I have an SD card here it's a 16 gigabyte micro SD. It's formatted into the FAT32 file system. Insert it into a card reader. So it's here. And I downloaded the firmware using OpenTX Companion. Download that program. Connect the radio through the micro USB port to the PC. Read it from here. And then at download, it's already set up. Download firmware button is here and I downloaded it to the SD card which is there and I placed it into the firmware folder and it's this one so let's download it and save it directly onto the memory card into the firmware folder opentx.bin is the name save it, yes I want to replace it now it's downloading it do you want to write the firmware to the radio now? That did not work for me, so I will choose no. Remove the memory card. Let's power it off first. Insert it into the radio. Now press and hold this button, all of the buttons, and then power it on. So try to press all of it. Press it well, and then power it on. And that's it. It says write firmware, restore EEPROM and exit. So let's go to the first one, write firmware. It's already detecting that file because it was in the correct folder. Let's press the joystick. It says version 2.3.9 and hold enter to start. So hold the same joystick and it's writing it. Writing complete. Let's go to exit. Welcome to OpenTX. That's the SD card warning. I have to modify that file. If I long press the joystick to the left, we are on the first page. Let's go to the seventh one. It's version 2.3.9. So OpenTX was updated on this Terranis X Lite radio.